Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be part two of the As I Am product review. We did the wash day video in my previous video looking at how the cleansing pudding works. And today I'm going to show you how I moisturize my hair using some of the As I Am products that they gave me. So I do my moisturizing using the LCO method. So the L will be the As I Am leave-in conditioner. The C, that is the cream, will be this moisture milk. And then I'm going to moisturize or seal it all in with the sheer, sheer butter and my oil mixture. So stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Thanks. So I'm braiding my hair today. So it's gonna, I'm not going to do moisturizing of the whole head. I just want to get a feel for it. And I'm starting with braiding at the back. So I'm going to just moisturize this section and see how it feels. I'm going to braid my hair from wet because it just feels it keeps the moisture in for longer. But let's see. Okay. So my hair is semi-damp. It was freshly washed and I've allowed it to dry out a little bit. So like I said, we'll start off with the leave-in conditioner. It has a nice fragrance to it. It's light, not overpowering for those that don't like overpowering scents. Let's see the consistency. Okay, it's not too thick, but it's also not too watery. So I'm going to use, like I said, I'm always a little bit generous with my products. Um, so I'm going to use this amount on this section of hair. Rub it onto my hand, it smears nicely, and then just apply it to this section of hair. Especially because I'm going to be braiding the hair away, I don't mind using a lot of it. It does really have a nice fragrance to it. Mm. It has a nice, it smooths on well. And then the moisture milk as my cream. It also has the same light fragrance. It looks like so. Let's see the consistency. Okay, so this is a bit thicker than the leave-in conditioner. It actually feels like a cream. So I'm gonna use that much as well. The other reason why I'm using a lot for this fairly tiny section is because this is a section of my hair that is very coarse and prone to knotting. So I'm always over generous with this side. And then I want to make sure that I get my edges also nice, I mean not the edges, the ends rather, nice and coated with the product. Okay. So I'm making sure to work it in well so that it's going to be absorbed well. And then I'm gonna go in and seal it in using my shea butter and oil mix. So I add a little bit of shea butter to my hands. And then my oil mix. And then we're gonna use that. Rub that in and apply it on the hair to seal in the product. Seal in the moisture. So I detangled before I washed my hair. Um, I'm not going to comb it now so that I don't over manipulate the hair. I'm going to comb when I'm sectioning the hair. So I'm going to um, twist this up. Like I said, I'm going to start at the back. So I'm going to 
um, what do you call this thing? Moisturize all four of my back sections. And then, oh, let me just let you see how the hair looks. Just and look. Obviously, because I'm braiding immediately, I won't be able to see how I don't need to twist it this time actually because I'm braiding. So one more section. This section already feels nice, it feels soft, so I'm hoping that the moisture will stay locked in as I put the hair into braids. But yeah, so let me just do one more section and then I'll just get on with the program. So again, the leave-in conditioner, nice consistency, not too thick, not too thin. Apply it to the hair, making sure that I do put it on my roots. I mean, on my edges, on my ends rather. <laughs> on my ends. Then the moisture milk as the cream. And then my uh, oil. Okay, so what I can notice from the immediate application is that my hair is nice and soft. Like I said, it has a nice fragrance, it's not too strong, but the hair is really nice and soft. So I hope it will keep the moisture in for longer. Um, yeah, let me get to braiding, guys. So let me know in the comment section below if you try these two products on your own head of hair. Let me know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Thanks. See you in my next video. Bye.